<laughs> no, truthfully, I mean, people look at us like, what are you doing? Yeah. It's much easier to yep. plant vines out there. Why have we kept it? It's in our blood. Well, my great-grandfather came over from Scotland. He earned enough money that he could buy this ranch in 1904. In 1890s, my family had a dairy in Berryessa. In fact, our mothers were in the same high school class together. It yep. used to be a very small town. town. I found out about uh, the Belt of Galloways, loved everything about them, and started out with four. And now we're slightly under 100. 100 yeah. yeah. We, we've seen a big demand in grass-fed beef. It's amazing how people are really interested where their meat comes from, from the moment that they are born until the moment that it's time for their end. They remain right on the They are here. They never leave Napa Valley. Right. <laughs> Once you see Belt and Galloway, we don't forget them. If we don't keep our gates locked, <laughs> we have tour buses that we've come up the driveway. And then all of a sudden, all these people pile out. Taking pictures. <laughs> yeah. We're fortunate that past generations didn't sell, because once you sell, it's gone. There's enough vines in the valley. I mean, it's, it's nice to see some animals out here. There's more to life than just yourself. If you want to benefit from God's place here, I mean, this is beautiful, and you got to work a little bit to reap the rewards. You have to take care of it, and it takes care of you. Yeah.